-hmm. chicken and I have ground beef also I have some pork chops salmon some more chicken chicken that's a large thing of chicken there be a barbecue one thing of ground beef some leftover ice cream from 4th of July some fries shrimp then I also have some leftover frozen uh, fresh vegetables steak tortillas Okay, so here is my menu plan for July 16th through the 22nd there on Monday, which is tonight. We're just having leftover spaghetti with the artichoke pepperoni salad. And I actually went to the grocery store and I forgot the jar or the can of the artichoke hearts. My bad. But I did went ahead and I just made it somewhat similar to the recipe, which I will include the video here use these lunchables and it has pepperoni mozzarella so i just it was enough just enough to place in three for jay's um lunch looks good though so it was really delicious very good and i like how i use the lunchable on that <laughs> um i normally will film stuff like that in my vlogs if you kind of want to watch the rest of the meals here on Tuesday, I'm going to try a new recipe out of this gooseberry patch from the thrift store finds and haul. I'll link the video somewhere around here. And it's by Gooseberry Ready Set Christmas. And I really like this. It has all kinds of, of um, recipes from numerous people all over from all over the place and the recipe I am going to try tonight to try the Franciscan chicken by Shirley Howie from Foxboro Massachusetts sounds delicious Shirley <laughs> so I'm gonna make that on Tuesday with some fresh green beans with some minced fresh garlic yum wednesday i'm going to also try a recipe that i was unable to try out in vegas it didn't go as planned and that sometimes happens so i'm just going to go ahead and try that recipe on wednesday the hot and sour soup 
and I'm also going to open up that box of the um, the frozen vegetable rolls that I have in there so that should be really good for Wednesday okay Thursday night I am keeping it light using again from the thrift store finds I found this best of Weight Watchers magazine and in here I found mm -hmm. This is the penne with mushrooms, Italian sausage, and broccoli. Doesn't that look good? Oh, so I have everything except for the broccoli, and I've never really tried turkey sausage yet, so I'm willing to try that. I think that's going to be probably just served by itself, only because it just seems really filling for me, but I don't know. I might serve it maybe with some extra fresh broccoli on the side. Friday, I'm going to have the hubby smoke some salmon since we have some frozen salmon in the freezer. I'm also going to try another new recipe, the tomatoes grilled with basil and garlic. Again, I found this recipe on the Weight Watchers magazine book. Tomato season is coming in, although I don't have my tomatoes fully yet ready to harvest, but I am definitely in the mood for some basil and garlic and tomatoes. Mmm, sounds so good and very light. I think I'm going to serve that with rice on the side. Saturday night, hubby and I have a date, so I'm going to order for pizza. But I will make a fresh green salad to go with that for mom. And look at that. Sunday is completely empty. So who knows? I really don't know at this point. I'm going to stick with one that we all enjoyed. The Salisbury steak and caramelized onion gravy. You can check this out on my Pinterest. I have all of my recipes that I have tried or will be trying <laughs> on my Pinterest board. I'll link that somewhere around here too. So I'm going to serve that over with some mashed potatoes. Here are the necessary items that I'm going to need for this week's meal plan. And I think that's it. But pretty much I'm trying to use up everything that I have in my freezer and pantry. And yeah, that's the goal here. So okay. I love getting recipes from recipe books that I find at various places or on social media like my Pinterest and um, you know I think cooking is great. I believe I'm really starting to enjoy cooking at home now. So if you are new to my channel I would love it if you would click that subscribe button and thank you so much for watching until the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, I look like a hot mess. <laughs> Bye.